We got down to the beach nice and early this morning and we were quite surprised to find just how hard the offshore wind was blowing. So we got the boat ready on a relatively low tide and decided to try out one of our favorite manta reefs. This dive site goes by the name of Bikini because although it is relatively small, it hides a lot. The water was typically not very clean for this time of year and this is also associated with more plankton in the water because the sea temperatures are slightly lower than in summer. This ledge is the main reason that the mantis tend to aggregate here. As the current passes this ledge, it causes upwellings and the mantis tend to stick around here because it assists with their feeding patterns. It's also home to numerous other fish and these big tomato rock cod as well as the butterfly fish are usually resident within this cleaning station. While we were staring up into the distance and looking at the water above us for these huge rays, something caught our attention on the reef itself. This is an absolutely stunning specimen of an octopus. It's rather large and at this point it's probably standing nearly a foot up off the reef. You can see with absolute ease and gracefulness that this creature begins to work its way over the top of the reef. It almost seems to be floating on a bit of a hydrofoil. You can see the way it changes its color. The texture is slightly bubbled and this is matching the algae on the rock itself. And it assists in catching prey as well as avoiding potential predators. A lot of the time when we do encounter these octopus, they're quite shy creatures and they'll usually retreat within their holes pretty quickly. But perhaps because of the size of this individual, it is more confident and that's why it has revealed itself as well as exposed itself on the top of the reef. Here in the background you can see that big plate coral and not only is it matching the texture of the plate coral itself but it's also matched the color pretty much exactly. Down below you have eight long legs with these beautiful strong suction cups with which the octopus will actually use to grasp its prey. The octopus is an absolutely fascinating creature as it actually has no bones within the body and it can fit into pretty much any hole or crevice and has been known to actually climb in through the neck of glass bottles. gets slightly startled and eventually retreats back into the hole. 